Hi, I am Sujoy and today I will show you how to do Bessel's interpolation easily. So our question is find f of x at x equals to 7 from the following data. Here some x values are given. Corresponding f of x values or function of x values are given. Solution. Let's construct the Bessel's interpolation table. It's very easy. So in the x column, write down all x values starting from 2 to 10. So the middle value of x will be x0, values above x0 will be x minus 1, x minus 2 and so on. Values below x0 will be x1, x2 and so on. Next, in y or f of x column, write down all f of x values starting from 5 to 901. So the value correspond to x0 will be y0 and the values above y0 will be y minus 1, y minus 2 and so on. Values below y0 will be y1, y2 and so on. Next to find del y, starting from bottom, this value minus this value is this value. 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 To find del square y, starting from bottom, this value minus this value is this value. This value minus this value is this value. This value minus this value is this value. To find del cube y, starting from bottom, this value minus this value is this value. This value minus this value is this value. To find del to the power 4 y, starting from bottom, this value minus this value is this value. And next, the Bessel's formula. f of x equals to y0 plus y1 divided by 2 plus v into del y0 plus v square minus 1 by 4 divided by factorial 2 into del square y0 plus del square y minus 1 divided by 2 plus v into v square minus 1 by 4 divided by factorial 3 into del cube y minus 1 plus v square minus 1 by 4 into b square minus 9 by 4 divided by factorial 4 into del to the power 4 y minus 1 plus del to the power 4 y minus 2 divided by 2 and so on where v is given by u minus 1 by 2 where u is x minus x 0 by h where x is the value of x for which f of x need to be found so here we have to find f of x for x equal to 7. So our x is 7. And x0 is the value above or below x in the x column. So here x is 7 and the value above 7 is 6. That will be our x0 value. Next is h is the difference between each value of x. Also called interval gap. So the difference between each value of x is 2. So our h equals to 2. So putting in the formula x minus x0 by h minus half that is 7 minus 6 by 2 minus half equals to 0. So v equals to 0. So let's put the values in the Bessel's formula f of x equals to y0 plus y1 by 2 181 plus 449 by 2 plus v into del y0 0 into 268 plus b square minus 1 by 4 divided by factorial 2 0 square minus 1 by 4 divided by factorial 2 into del square y0 plus del square y minus 1 by 2 184 for plus 136 by 2 plus v into v square minus 1 by 4 by factorial 3 0 into 0 square minus 1 by 4 divided by factorial 3 into del cube y minus 1 that is into 48 we will not do the fourth term since our del to the power 4 y 0 is 0 so 181 plus 449 by 2 is 315 plus 0 into anything is 0 plus 0 square minus 1 by 4 by factorial 2 is minus 1 by 8 into 184 plus 136 by 2 is 160 plus 0 into anything is 0 and 0 divided by anything is 0 
and 0 into anything is 0. So the third term is 0. So 315 plus minus 20 plus 0 equals to 295. So y or f of 7 equals to 295. That means for x equals to 7, f of x is 295. Here some notes for you. Bessel's interpolation formula is similar to Newton's forward and backward interpolation formulas where the difference between each value of x is same that is interval gap or h is fixed. When the interval gap is not same we use Newton's divided difference or the language interpolation formula. All the previous formulas are used to find f of x or y of x that is the value of y for given x value. But to find the x of y that is the value of x for given y value we use inverse interpolation formula. I have videos on all the methods I discussed. Link to all of them is in the video description below. So that's it for now. How was the video? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. That would really encourage me. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video.